Hello team and welcome to today's video where I'm going to be sharing with you how to insert images into cells within your Excel spreadsheet. Normally if you insert an image using the pictures option on the insert tab, the image floats around the spreadsheet and you have to resize it and align it to the cell that it belongs to. However, using the image function, the image is linked within the respective cell and this has a couple of different benefits. If I sort the candy type that I have here from Z to A, you'll see the images adjust and align to their original respective fields. Additionally, if I resize these rows, the images will auto adjust for the new cell size. Let's take a look at how this function works. To begin, I want to insert an image for the candy type of taffy. In order to do so, I'll enter the image function. The image function has only one required argument, which is the source of the image. Keep in mind the source must be a URL that begins with the HTTPS prefix. While we will primarily be looking at the required argument today for the source, the optional arguments include alternative text for accessibility, sizing options that Excel provides to you, and you can also choose a custom height and width for your function. In order to insert the URL, open up a quotation mark, paste the URL, close quotations, close parentheses, and click enter. And now team, you can see our image has been inserted. You can also insert these images utilizing a cell reference with the URL included. If for example, I double click the function that I just input and highlight the source, I can change that to the cell reference of D2 and click enter. And you'll see the same image appears. I've already inserted my URL for the other candy types. So what I can do is drag this formula down and you'll see the other images have been inserted. And now team, as you can see, if I change the way these are sorted, the images adjust. And if I change the row sizing, the images adjust to fit as well. Keep in mind, you have those other optional arguments within the function to change the sizing or the position of the image. Team, I hope you enjoyed this tip today. Please like and subscribe to the channel for future videos.